sleep paralysis, a temporary inability to move or speak while falling asleep or upon waking. It all started in middle school, around eighth grade. It was a stressful day full of tests. I was ready to go home and sleep. So when I finally made it home after doing everything I needed to do, it was bedtime and I was so happy to sleep. I turned my lights off and laid in bed and fell asleep around 10 p.m. A few hours go by and I start noticing I'm waking up. My eyes start to open slowly and my body felt a little strange, like static. I tried to move, but my body, my body was paralyzed. I tried to scream for my mom, but nothing came out. I didn't know what to do. I kept trying to move, but it felt like someone's body was on me, even though no one was there. I was stuck laying there with my eyes open. As I looked around my room, I noticed something in the corner of my eye. Something darker than my room. Something that didn't belong. It was a shadow. I knew I couldn't use my voice. So I shut my eyes and started praying in my head. Lord, please protect me from any evil spirit. I said this ten times and I kept feeling the present getting stronger and stronger and then it disappeared I opened my eyes and tried to move my legs were able to move now I ran out of my room into my brother's room but this was only the beginning of many nightmares to come to this day I have had about 40 sleep paralysis episodes Having sleep paralysis is very horrifying because the things you see cannot be unseen. I decided to share my sleep paralysis experience with y'all. It is very, very, very common amongst anyone, doesn't matter what age you are. Sleep paralysis is like being in an in-between state, which you are because your mind is fully awake but your body isn't. And everything that you feel, see, experience during sleep paralysis, you will remember. Because I remember every single experience that happened to me while in that state. And it is something you cannot forget. It is something that can turn into nightmares. <laughs>